How much energy does it take to push a helium atom into a benzene ring? Let's find out using quantum molecular dynamics. Give the nuclei their initial velocity, benzene's atoms at rest, and helium say 10 nanometer per picosecond. Motion of nuclei are treated with simple Newton's laws of motion F equals ma, knowing the initial velocities, masses, and net forces, we can compute the nuclei's path of motion. Think of projectile motion in high school. Where does the quantum come in? Motions of electrons are treated quantum mechanically using the Schrodinger equation. With so many interacting electrons and nuclei, the equation is complicated, but basically it gives the energy and forces acting on the nuclei. In short, quantum computes forces and Newton uses the forces to compute the path of motion. Let's see what happens. 3, 2, 1, go! Oh, uh oh, it's slowing down and bounces back. The initial speed in this case is not fast enough. Let's try something faster. It's gonna make it, I can feel it. Yes, e yes. <laughs> Experimentally, embedding atoms into a larger cage like molecules has been done. Like putting helium inside, I'm not even gonna read that, or encapsulating water molecule inside C60 molecule. With CM quantum program, you can easily perform the simulation. 1. Prepare 3D structure file with the benzene on top and helium atom at the bottom. 2. Construct velocity file, setting the benzene's atoms at rest while the helium having the desired velocity and three, run the program with simple options. This argument specify the initial 3D structure, the file name to read basis set information. The keyword activates QMD simulation, the file name to read velocities, and the number of iteration. Siam Quantum save the file traj.xyz which contains the position of all the nuclei as a function of time. And goodbye for now. Kay kid my watamai nawani Rousing Ma Ram Rianti Nare Soon Rudangwa Shad Gon Kao เราได้ทบทวนจึงกลับหวนคืนทิมแผ่นดินเดิมหรือจะเป็นทหารกล้าองค์สมเด็จผู้ปกเกตป้องพระไทยใจเฮือเคิน